Welcome to a very special Tuesday stream. It snowed twice in South Carolina this year. I don't even know what's happening anymore. Uh, we had some salacious video game news today, okay? We have the Nintendo news is just, it is top tier today. Okay, so the first thing is check out this fucking camera. I can't get over it. I'm sorry. I'm going to be completely conceited right now and just tell y'all I've never been like Mark is out of town y'all I set this up by myself and look at I didn't fuck it up and then I fixed the microphone just now which means that I'm learning like I'm learning the OBS I am not just using the OBS that is exciting because Maggie can now run her own stream now you can see her in HD so that's good um I did my nails today for the first time in a long time I got a shower. Mental health is very important. And I was not taking care of mine last week. So, okay. Uh, so the EA shareholders meeting was today. And uh, <laughs> during it, apparently someone brought up Battlefield 2042. And everybody just really gave them side eye. Uh, because it is, it's not doing well, y'all. It's not doing well. It's not terrible, but it's it's not doing well. What's that move? However, I will say this, and they I hate that articles are always like everything is terrible. Because like EA Electronic Arts, like they own Apex Legends, right? And Apex Legends like grew by 28 million players last year or some shit. It might have even been like last quarter. It was it was fucking crazy. She just really needs attention today, y'all. <laughs> oh, yeah. In other news, we have a new segment on the channel. And I'm very excited to announce this because the name is, is very good. So we have a new segment on the channel as of today called You People Have Too Much Money. <laughs> so, y'all remember how I was talking about how the EA shareholders meeting was today, right? Well, let me just tell you about the dipshittedness that every other company did today. First of all, Team 17, my beloved Team 17, has betrayed me. They have gotten too much money. No, 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 no. That that happens during E3, right? No, you're getting a lot better. I think you need to give yourself more credit, by the way. Uh, so, you people have too much money. Team, 70, team 17 has decided that they are behind video games having NFTs. I have a lot of feelings about this. The conference. The media conference. The meeting? <laughs> the conference? Ah, uh, I have a lot of feelings about this. Mostly, I don't think that video game players know what they're doing when they invest in these NFTs. Uh, I understand that it is a new media for a new kind of market. Uh, however, it potentially has damaging effects to smaller indie titles. And I was thinking about making a blog post about it, because like, I've been doing a lot of research on it lately. Anyways. Uh, <clears throat> next up in You People have too much money. Say it with me. So last week we talked about how Take-Two Balsinga <laughs> for 12.7 billion. Today, Microsoft and Sony were ripping their dicks out all over the Twitterverse. And uh, essentially what happened was Microsoft, after buying Activision and Blizzard, uh, the, the the FTC stepped in. Uh, for those of you who don't know, maybe across the pond, the FTC <laughs> is the Federal Trade Commission. And they have decided that quite possibly Microsoft owns too many assets and it would be damaging to the video game industry going forward if they did go through with the sale of both of these companies to Microsoft. So yeah, the FTC came in and was like, shut the fuck up, Microsoft. You're spending too much money. This may or may not be a Monopoly. You bought Monopoly last year. Like, get it together. And Microsoft's like, all right, I, I'm pretty sure we covered all of our bases. A lot of people are scrutinizing that this may have been, like, completely fine to do up until the point where Blizzard fucked up with all the lawsuits this past year. And to that, I want to say, fuck you. 
Uh, Blizzard, Blizzard's been fucking up for a while, first of all. And secondly, uh, that definitely sounds like you're fucking shaming people for coming forward. Don't blame the downfall of a company or a monopoly on fucking victims of sexual assault. Go fuck yourselves, Twitter nerds. Go fuck yourselves. So then Sony turned around today and Sony was like, hold my beer. I'm gonna buy Bungie. And everybody was like, wait, you're gonna do what? You're gonna do what? Uh, Bungie, for those of you who don't know, is the original developer of... <laughs> the Halo franchise. It's so stupid. It's so stupid. The the Twitter was just a hot fucking garbage mess today. Speaking of hot fucking garbage messes, uh, when asked to comment by someone who obviously did not know who they were speaking to, Jeff Keighley of the Summer Games said, multiple people were in possibly large acquisitions that could be big, that's a direct quote, going forward in the video game industry, and he hopes to see what it's like. Jeff, I know global warming is real and it feels like summer almost all the time, but sit the fuck down. Sit the fuck down, Jeff Keighley. Sit down. Sit down. Shut up. Just stop. That's enough. <sighs> so, that concludes You People Have Too Much Money. So, we'll be back tomorrow. I don't know. Streams this week are going to be weird. Mark is out of town for work right now. Uh, he's in a different time, so it's crazy. And, you know, Valentine's Day is coming up. Things like that, so. We'll get back to it. Uh, I do. I love the, the improvements to the stream that we're making right now. Um, and hopefully tomorrow I'll have some super fun social media content for you guys. That's a thing that you have to do as a content creator that I've been postponing because it makes me rageful. So, I love you guys. Be good, be good. Take care of you. Go be the change and whatnot. Don't forget that our Discord is open if you ever need anything. I know there's some severe weather rolling through the United States right now, so if you guys need a support team or a network or something like that, just let us know. But yeah, you guys, I love you unconditionally, and we will see you soon. I love you guys. Bye!